Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mulklover, and thank you for joining me back here in Old World Blues, playing as New Sterling's Brotherhood. So, last time we struggled a little bit to take out dead horses, but they've been taken out regardless, and we also took out High Chapel. So right now, we are poised to strike into the land of the Forgers, who is currently in a war against the Navajo Nation. So, um, a couple things before we start, really. Um, both the Navajo Nation, as well as the Forgers... They both have anti-tank on a lot of their divisions, so yeah, I'm not really sure if we can succeed too much using just light robots. We're probably not going to try to keep light robots for the entire game, of course, but we'll see what happens. I have been trying to make a heavy robot division with four heavy robot battalions, two APC battalions, first time I've really used them on this channel, as well as one light robot uh, battalion as well, just to make it 20 combat width. Mm, I'm debating getting rid of this, though. What if I instead threw on a power armor to, uh, battalion? No, that'd be too large. That's too large, darn it. That's why I need 18 combat width. I was thinking about that, but... Oh, well. Reset. We're making this division. I haven't thrown on anything here yet. I don't like... Maintenance company isn't bad. If I throw on a power armor support, I might do that for my infantry. But speaking of support battalions... I have asked you yesterday what type of support companies I should use. And I don't want to be criticized or recommended to try different things out when my own subscribers recommend things for me to do. For example, someone said, use dogs, use chemical companies, use demo, maybe use power armor, use machine guns or fire teams, and maybe logistics. Five out of the six, someone also recommended that I use robots, or at least um, recon, put some recon on these divisions, which I think sounds like a pretty good idea. Or even try power armor, like I said earlier. So, that is the support companies that my subscribers have suggested. Now, while I do that, I'll probably throw on some recon. These guys could use it. I already have, you know, a maintenance company on my robots, my regular light robots, which are okay. They're not great, but they're okay. And, of course, with the heavy ro robots, we got nothing on there as well. Over time, our APCs will get stronger and stronger, so our armor will go up. So, I really don't want to hurt our armor too much. Even if I throw on the power armor support, it still hurts us a little bit. Yeah, I don't want to hurt my arm too much because the enemies can already pierce me and I don't like that. So, and we have some APC divisions. It's only 20 combat width, which isn't bad. But if you want armor, 33%, uh, 27 isn't great, so... Really have to wait on that. Besides, here. Let's go to... Let's see. Let's go duplicate that. New division. Iron Alliance Raiders. Power armor. Um, well, hold on. Division designer, just go ahead and duplicate that. Won't really matter since I'm going to see if I can maybe produce a, and eventually, a power armor division. Since I, I still want them. Don't get me wrong, it sounds like my cat is now outside the door. Yep, Binky is complaining for me to bring him in. Ah, uh, oh, yeah, this is going to take a lot of army XP to do. Let's see, get rid of that here. Now, what about power armor demo companies? Because this only hurts your supply use, weight, and cell usage. This hurts your supply use suppression organization a little bit. Um, armor isn't great. I'd have to research more and more into so, uh, power armor. 22, 6, oh, it gives you a little more piercing. 82, oh, it gives you way more breakthrough and way more soft attack. Does increase supply use. Um, infantry. Uh, and what if he did? Fire teams aren't bad either. But we want more HP, more stuff like that. That's not bad. I've never used this. Just power armor and power armor demolition. That's interesting. Of course, they don't have very much power armor whatsoever, but then again, my power armor isn't great that I can currently produce. So, we'll keep it on like this for now. Uh, let's see if I remove that. That'll actually give us more... Uh, that does take hurt our breakthrough if I get rid of it. What if I got rid of demo support? I'm going to get rid of doggo support. Hmm... I might just keep them on. Just keep them on for that for now. Some basic power armor templates. Cool. So, really, my goal in this episode is to go to war with the Foragers, see what happens. Um, let's see. 
Oh, I do want to remind you. Oh, the Brotherhood just declared war on the Shi for some reason. Three losses, 4,000, 18,000. Wow. The Troll Warren are doing a great job on Brotherhood to Seal. The Master's Army. Holy cow. Uh, NCR Legion War, 67,000, 25,000. I do want, like I said, I want to remind you that, uh, not bad. I will not be here today or tomorrow or the next day. So the next few days will be more Iron Alliance stuff. Of course, that's normal, but with, holy cow. Uh, the Sheev gone wild. But without a lot of input from my comments, still leave comments. I'm still, I'm still going to read them, but I just can't interact with them too much. Nice. We got a little bit more breakthrough. It's 2281. And like I said earlier, I didn't want to get to these robots, but it's 177 days ahead of time. Also, I forgot the Gauss rifles in the last episode, but unfortunately, it takes 544 days to actually research them for some reason. Not sure why. As well as a plasma rifle. So, we have it unlocked, but we. We need to actually research it to use it, so that kind of sucks. <clears throat> that being said, energy weapons? Yeah, let's go with some more lasers. And I will go to war with these guys soon enough. I want to see them struggle against each other just a little bit more first. Their manpower isn't bad. They've got quite a few divisions. Obviously, we don't have nearly as many divisions. Um, we get the River Gods done with this infantry. They have a little bit more, but a lot more manpower. River Gods, very good. Anything else on the right? I'll be honest, if you're in my Discord, you know what I'm going to do already, so I might as well tell you now. I'm going to go ahead and probably enslave the Mormons, get rid of them, just because, well, honestly, the next playthrough, we're going to become holy, we're going to deus vault, if you know what I mean. So, from the western old world state of Utah, a Mormon mission has arrived on our turf. It's time to decide what to do with these Canaanite bastards. Also, I, if I ever play the Iron Alliance again, I'm definitely going to do it differently by using much more only almost exclusively power armor in, the, in another potential iron alliance breakthrough and also join the mormons because why not we why not play as a mormon power armor brotherhood raider nation so the mormon question while the iron alliance was aware of the mormons from the west the crew never really communicated with them face to face this encounter was the first contact that new Canaanites had made with the Alliance. According to their leaders, the mission of the Mormons was to spread the gospel and to cleanse the Colorado Raiders of their sin. The Iron Alliance has chose to either reject the Mormons or accept their forgiveness. It is time to decide which path we take. And like I just explained, I'm going to go with the road to the west. Screw new Canaan, the Iron Alliance does not need to cooperate with these Mormon nuts. It's time to push to, new, to the new Canaanites by conquering yet another tribal nation. Subduing so Yinta will greatly improve the Iron Alliance's strategic position against new Canaan. I'm sorry if I've, I have disappointed you. I might come back and play the Iron Alliance again someday, but I think considering the next campaign, this is for the best. If I go to war with the Grand Tribes, all I get is scrap. If I go to war with Tar Walkers, they're not in the Mormon Alliance yet. They do have a little bit of energy, which isn't bad. We've got to keep in mind of our energy. There's really so much limited circuitry. But if I can't take out the Forges, we get quite a bit more of it, which would be great. Uh, Mexico's on fire again, but, you know, that's Mexico. I did not know that the Master's new army was doing so well. I would be scared if I was antelope tribes. Just a bunch of antelopes, just kind of hanging out here and just being completely surrounded on every side. Oof. Oh, the Nevada Pact is here with uh, the Desert Rangers of the Northern League. Automated harvesting, very good. Very good. Not bad, not bad. Oh, more monthly population? Sure. I do need more support companies. I keep saying that, but I don't ever do it. Mesmer's Protectron's not bad. I mean, just using light robots it isn't bad whatsoever. Just, they're, they're not strong. Breakthrough's pretty good. Armor is okay. The weight, 10 weight. It goes Mexico again. I mean, these heavy ones, it's almost the same weight. Using APCs and heavy uh, robot battalions. So We do have 100 factories, which is nice. That's pretty good. Stockpile-wise, we're doing pretty well in everything except for bomber planes and even support robots to a degree. Actually, we make quite a few support robots. Maybe it's time to... Where's my support robots? Make more of those and decrease this. Yeah, we want to focus more on sentry robots. We have this extra political power. Justify war goals time. Yeah, we're definitely going to need more justify war goals time. Power armor hardness. Reserved AI. More entrenchment. Uh, growth. Production... Production efficiency base and growth, that's really good. I'm probably going to go with that. Chem pusher. You can get so much war support, or so much stability weekly by doing that, but that's okay. Daily political power. More attack. I don't mind getting more attack in exchange for more non-core manpower. It's not bad. 
Do we need to research anything? Hmm. I mean, technically, yeah, but technically not too much. Reliability, reliability is not bad. Uh, go ahead and just grab. Quick ask. I want to produce more, 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 more salvaged cars. Nice. So we can get a wasteland car and get to these volatile fuels and stuff like that. Next up. I want more doggos, but someone said, yeah, let's get some chem companies. Those will be important on the robots. On the robots? On the infantry. Since I'm still using infantry here. Uh, how's this going? Uh, losses so far. Any losses I don't have to cause are, is good, for, good with me. Ooh, the Navajo Nation isn't doing great. They're actually losing quite a bit more manpower. They probably are attacking like crazy, but they can't do anything. All my divisions around here. Uh, why are you over there? Is that because of supply, maybe? That doesn't make any sense. Any upgrades? Probably not. Level 4 general. Level 5. Thieving numbers. Not bad. Well, if I go to war, they're going to pull some divisions towards me. The forgers will. I don't know how well I can hold. We only have 16 planes. That's not much. But you never know until we try. Go ahead and move in if you can, my robotos. Why don't you get up there as well? If you can break across the river, that'd be awesome. Take you, come over there. Take you, take that tile. And you take that. And we immediately get attacked. Alright, that's fine. I'm totally fine with holding. Uh, they're attacking me over a river, so I'm obviously just going to stay there the entire time. They shouldn't be able to break those infantry divisions. They're 20 combat width. They're not that bad. But I do have some coffee here. How are we almost 12 minutes into this video? What the heck? It feels like I just started it. Ugh. Terrible. It sounds like my cat Binky's outside my room again. Such a needy boy. So needy. Alright, very good. Got some experience. Let our robots move in. Awesome. Good stuff. Good stuff. Let's see. Divert soldiers away. Move up as far as you possibly can, I guess, at the moment. That'd probably be for the best. Take all the territory that you can. Okay, I'm not sure why you did that. I don't mind you just staying right... Oh, boy. No, 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 no. Yeah, um, I'd like it if you just stay in that tile there. Yeah, that that's a little awkward to do. Just do that, it's fine. Make your way down here. Come down here, to here, to here. Slowly but surely, take them all out. Ooh, robots, can they pierce me? Yes, they can. But we can pierce them back, even though they're using just, um, stuff like that. That isn't bad. Make your way downtown. Oh, take all this territory if you can. That'd be great. Take their factories, take their resources. They don't need any of that stuff. Salida? Oh, we, we had to um, use people from Salida, if I do remember correctly, to help us get rid of this br bad effects or something, something like that. I think so. Oh, and we instantly start getting attacked. And they can pierce me. That's not fun. That's not a lot of fun at all. With you, you hold. You move that way. They're gonna need some support. And for now, get the planes going. Help them out the best you can. Don't want to lose too much here. Nice. Go ahead and grab Salida. You guys come down that way. Uh, you guys probably need to move up this direction. Thank you. Yeah, they're going to attack me like crazy. This, this, these two divisions are going to get hit pretty hard. Anti-grav engines, more speed. I robots, century robots, plant doctrines, specialized doctrines. Um, planes. Rotary bombers, all of duty, more aircraft and stuff like that. Industry. Research speed it is. Alright, I want you guys to... Actually, you know what? Go ahead and get rid of this. I need all you guys on the line up here. Or a fallback line, because the way this works is not very smart. Go ahead and do that. Just come up to the front line. Hold that area. 
Um, you two. Something like that, maybe. You might get encircled. I hope you don't. Just hold on to Salida for now. And I realize we have another research thing at the top. Um, yeah. Energy cell conversion speed. Sounds like a good idea to me. You guys keep holding there. Losses so far. 28 versus... We've killed 500. Not bad. Now, over here, we might not do very well. I don't mind pulling one more robot off to come down here to hold. Hopefully, this helps out the Navajo Nation at least a little bit more so they can help push. We might get a push here as well. Keep an eye on the planes. 19 isn't bad. They can't get shot down if you don't use them. We might be able to attack right here, though, which would be kind of good. They do have three divisions. So we'll see what happens. Manpower, equipment. Uh, they're starting to run out of manpower maybe a little bit. They might have just mobilized more men, though. Oh, and there you go. See, this is exactly why I want to hold on here. Um, Actually, I don't mind holding on in just Salida. If you retreat, that's totally fine with me, yeah. Just go ahead and retreat. Three divisions holding in Salida. Good enough for me, ma'am. Now, the road to the west. Good. Oh, shut the door in the moments. We need to kill off Yinta. Let's get some Metal Raiders. Bullet Eater's fervor for obtaining power armor has only grown, especially now that the Iron Alliance has found New Sterling's Vault. Soon, Bullet Eater will accomplish his life's goal and bring an entirely new form of warfare to the east. Oh, and that is 10% more power armor, which isn't bad. Which I should really start making some. Salvaged cars. Yeah, I don't really use motorized. Salvaged power armor. Well, I don't want to make outdated stuff already. That's not really smart to do. What would happen if I decided to attack and use one division from here as well, using our planes? They can't pierce us over here. We're doing a little bit of damage with the few bombers that we have. We lost two already, dang. Nice. Very good. Very good. Now, what if I did this? There you go. That's much, much, but much better. Oh, they're still attacking us over here. Interesting. Uh, they can still pierce us, but we can pierce them, so it's kind of a good thing that we're defending on this side. Interesting. If I could attack this tile, I could cut these divisions off eventually, and that would be glorious. Especially if they're suffering from attrition right now. So, I take all but you, and then take all of you back this way. If possible, they should be able to circle, destroy. We got a little bit of healing powder, and... Uh, Maintenance companies, I keep looking for that for hope, reliability. I haven't done any anti-tank stuff. Vehicles. Um, I don't know why my phone just swapped over to Yahoo Mail, but okay. Mm, probably not that ahead of time. No thanks, Yahoo Mail. I'm okay. Awesome. Very good. Very good. And actually, you probably don't need everyone moving that direction. Good. Now we have made an small, almost encirclement. An almost encirclement. I love it. Ah. Oh, they have a little bit of supply from Glenwood Springs, but that's not bad. Are we getting attacked down here? That's a good question. Oh, bing bing. We lost 43 guys so far. Um, are we getting attacked? Yes, we are. Well, let's like, look at the battle. Bing bing. Come on. Come on, bing. All right, then Binky's coming on. Binky, come on. Bink, come on. Yeah. Yeah, you want your chair? No. Okay, you don't want your chair. You want sunshine. All right. Well, you can have the sunshine. That's fine with me. There ain't a lot of room in my room for you, but whatever. Cool. So we're doing just a little bit of damage with our planes. Yeah, you okay, Bink? What a special fella. Um, oh, I didn't realize that that was actually connected still over there. Cool. Take two divisions, help attack here, and use the infantry as well. Using whatever planes we currently have. At least this time, we're not going to lose any divisions because we actually have uh, energy cells. And Navajo Nation is doing a little bit better. Gene crops are very good. Construction, absolutely. Good. I mean... Oh, are we attacking? Oh, maybe we are. Okay, well, let the robots attack. Rampy Bink? You doing okay? Having a good day? Yeah, man. Yeah. You want someone to rob you? You want to make sure we don't get attacked in the rear? 
I don't like getting flanked. That's why we have flanked the enemies. Ah, bing bing. You want the chair? It's just basically his chair now. Nope, he doesn't want the chair. Cool. Uh, infantry, good job. I don't... I didn't mean for you to use that, but... Just hold on for now, and infantry... Well... Over time, these guys will die out. Good job, Bullet Eater. You're an infantry expert. Uh, let's see. We're not getting attacked over there. Ah, recycling. Very good, very good. Vehicle stuff. Let us get... Yeah? Now you want the chair. Okay, you finally want the chair. Supply use and max speed. Supply use... Yeah, let's get less supply use. I like that. Yeah? You okay, buddy? Yeah? You smelling the, uh, rest, the arm rest? Okay. Common energy weapons. Nice. More piercing. Okay, well, why not? Let these guys starve out. They have no organization, which is glorious. And it's almost 22. 82, right, Pink? That's right. Awesome, I've, I've waited long enough for this. Go ahead and terminate them. And once we get all the robots on this side, then we're just going to push hard in. Um, with Concerning this, I'll probably give the Navajo Nation like all of this territory, and that's pretty much it, probably. They really don't need very much. Down here... Uh, if I told them to push, they wouldn't probably do too badly. So... Give you a little bit of this, and go ahead and kill them off. Ah, uh, very nice. They only have this just because it's un... You can't get through this territory at all, so... There you go. Good job, Navajo Nation, and I'm totally not going to kill you next. But, Navajo Nation, you deserve at least a little bit of territory. Um... La Garita. If it wasn't for me, they wouldn't have any of this. If I gave them this... Well, let's see. Let's go from the top. Yeah? You want to bite my clothes again, Bink? Alright. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Um, let's see what that looks like. Not bad. I definitely want this stuff. Eagle Pass. Well, they didn't take this tile, so I'll take this from them. But I will be, I will be generous and give them this Uncompagre. And that's it. Nice. See, when we come together, we work together, and I totally won't come kill you right now. We can achieve a lot, my friends. We can achieve a whole lot. And two, three, four, five. Down here. Good. And I want your territory too. Awesome. And infantry. I'm going to set two infantry divisions down here, just in case, and have you two come up to Glenwood, not to hurt supply or anything like that, and planes, go and hang out, repair up, their range is really decent, holy cow, that's awesome range, but we did get quite a bit more circuitry, we have a, we have a surplus circuitry, thank god, thank god we got that now, holy cow, holy smokerinos, thank goodness we finally got enough circuitry, we can actually start making quite a few bombers, we can start making quite a few bit more sentry robots, APCs, also, one thing you didn't know, or I didn't know, that APCs require fire team weaponry, so I did not know that. Go ahead and throw on another unit there. That's awesome. I did not know that they needed that stuff. So that's why you might have seen me starting to produce some fire teams. You know, I really don't like them on my infantry. I don't know, I just didn't see them being super great. I generally just prefer demo companies. Next up, well, we're going to take out the Navajo Nation. We are done with our focus tree, which... I wish it was a little bit longer, a little bit, a little bit more in it, but that's okay. It's it's sub mod. I'm not expecting an extreme amount. I'm not expecting like Enclave Reborn style sub mods worth of stuff. So infrastructure. Oh my! What am I building? I'm building a lot of infrastructure. Would it be better for me to just get more political power though? Now some would say right now, I could. Let me. We're building up that. I could increase the amount of circuitry we could get by building up more infrastructure, and that's absolutely correct. So, that's not bad, but that comes with time. And, hmm, we're going to conquer more and more, so give me another set of, one more military factory. And you know what? How about we don't use a national focus right now? I want to get as much political power and use as much as of stuff as I possibly can. 
I want to finish off a lot of this stuff too, so let's get some common weaponry. Let's do that. So, Navajo Nation, you lost quite a few guys there. You have a lot of manpower left and a lot of divisions, which is not good for us. And, you know, just in case things don't go great, put a level 1 fort, or outpost, I should say, on each one of these. It's not much, but it might get the job done. Um, I'll get power armor technology next as well. Promises of loot. I love the loot. You okay, B? You like my, you like biting my sweatshirt? Oh, baby ink. Old world tech. Yeah, it's not bad. I could scavenge for stuff, but I don't really need to. I wanted to save it up just to get all this power armor stuff first. Uh, these divisions, they're looking pretty weak. They m must have lost a lot of equipment. Uh, oh, yes, we finally have a heavy robot division. Thank God. Um, actually, we might need to increase the infrastructure levels down here. They might not. Oh, level zero. Tier 0? Oh, it's not Tier 0. It's like Tier 10, but no infrastructure? Yeah, we gotta produce some infrastructure, man. Oh, we're building that up very quickly. I love it. I don't think we really need to focus on a Navy, though. Not really. Don't need to really build too much of an air base either. Level 1 forts. You know what? Build on one of these. I am just trying to make sure that we don't lose too much. I mean, we have a total of 16 divisions. They have, like, 70. I just want to make sure that we'll be okay. Yeah, they like 80, 70, 80. That's a lot like, for us to fight against. So, let's see. Equipment. We're doing really well on this stuff now. Support robots. Oh, not bad. I'll make some power armor later as I research more tech. I don't want to produce outdated stuff already, like I said. You okay, Bink? Start training a few more heavy robot divisions. And... By doing that, we're going to start switching over quite a bit of our factories that way. Oh, did I give more factories to someone else? Um, uh, that'll be better. Cool. Another Mesmer's Protectron. Really? Ah, we just produce it. We don't need that. We're making these heavy robots now. If that's the case, do that. Um, more research speed. Awesome. And we can go to war with who? Yinta. That's right. Yinta. But I want to kill all these people first. How is the war between the NCR and the Legion going? What? What? Binky is a very funny individual. Individual. Shisho Nation, she... They're still at war with each other, aren't they? Western Brotherhood? Yeah, they're still fighting. Not a lot of men. Oh, three divisions? If the Shi just navally invaded them, the Western Brotherhood would be dead. NCR. Kaiser's Legion has really stalled out trying to kill off the NCR, though. Additional storage. Scouring the old city. That's a lot of manpower. These have way more divisions and less manpower. Good. 2281. Mm. Recycling. I think our recycling speed is pretty good right now. Not gonna lie. Robots. Robotics. Oh, I can't do that yet. Darn it. Vehicles. Ah, oh, I can't do that yet either. Arr. Arr. Uh, maintenance companies. Yeah, let's do that. Since we have a little bit of army XP, we might as well use that. Since we use them on our robots anyways, uh... I don't want to do this, but it might be for the best. We lose a little bit of armor and piercing, but we get way more reliability. And equipment capture ratio. Do it. Screw it. Do it. Why not? Throw on that. Oh, we don't have enough army XP. I was going to throw on some chem companies on these guys. Hmm. Did I drop some coffee? Oh, oh crap, I did. Hmm. Well, that's okay. I'll oxyclean it later. Alright, uh, how many more days have we got until with these guys? Oh, there goes something in Mexico. We got replicators. We have about 40 more days. Let's research something really quick. And just blast on through this as we are slowly, slowly making more and more heavy robot divisions. Hmm... I'm not really going to use Spec Ops. They're great and all, but not really necessary. Good. Infrastructure is getting better and better all over the place, which is awesome. Um, if we had to build up... Oh, yeah, we have to build up all this stuff, too. We'll just throw them in the mix. Like, this is what I do every single campaign, no matter what I do. I just keep making infrastructure when I run out, run out of other things to make. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Whatever. Cool. 
Yeah, I mean, even if places you can't even get into, I'll just make it, because why not? Composites, nice. <clears throat> um, energy, uh, we were already pretty good. You okay, Bink? Yeah, Bink. Yeah, Bink? Yeah, you, you looking around or something? Bing, bing. Not a lot of room in my room right now. Moving stuff around. A little bit. Um, yeah. Come on. The longer we wait, the more equipment they can get. And that wouldn't be very good for us. But Kaisar, like, what are the losses of this war so far? NCR Legion, 82,000. That's not bad. That's really not bad at all. Right, Bink? You okay? You like growling at my clothes and... Anytime you, anytime he sits on my chair, he starts growling at me. For, for, not me, but starts growling at stuff. Awesome. Get some of that. Get some of that. Get some of that. Um, I don't want to hurt our defense. And eh, now he's sitting on the chair. Hopefully, I'll take a nap. I don't want to finish off a lot of this military staff stuff, so. And I'm kind of glad that it doesn't tell you for some reason that you can select a national focus. I guess what's it? It now realizes that once you've already done yours. It doesn't really care anymore to tell you. Infantry recon kits, land night attack, tower armor speed. That's a little bit ahead of time, which isn't bad. But what about planes? We're doing plane stuff. Gliders. More range. Strategic bombing. Bombing. Wait, strategic bombing, strategic bombing. Oh, strategic bomber, strategic bombing. More range. We're doing that. Specialized doctrine, aerial warfare. Special Forces, Robotics, uh, oh. Oh, what's the difference? Duraframe versus Protectron 2s. More Breakthrough, more Soft Attack, more Speed, more, same Piercing, same, uses way more cells, way more cost, less armor, which I don't like already. Yeah, I don't know. Soltrons, these are combat robots. So, those are okay. Look at that. Oh, let time go on. Because I want to go to war with these guys as fast as possible. Come on, guys. Less than 10 days. Less than 10 days before I need to go clean my bed sheet cover. Because I spilled coffee on it. Just a tiny drop. Just a tiny drop. Oh, goodness gracious. They're getting so many divisions up here now. Um, You know what? I'm going to send one division that way. And one division here, too. Actually, you know what? Just do that. There you go, just in case. You never know, Bullet Eater. Level 4, level 6, level 6. Not bad, not bad. So we should have quite a stockpile of support robots now. Yeah, focus a lot more on these guys. And APCs? Focus a lot more on those guys. Oh, there we go. We can go to war with them now. Uh, do that. There you go. Let's go, ahead and, let's go ahead and go to war. See what happens. Maybe it'll be great. Maybe it won't be great. Maybe we'll get started, started to get attacked like crazy. And they can pierce us. Thank God I put forts on here. Oh, if anything, we got 43, wow, 43 planes. That's amazing. I mean, earlier we had like nothing. I should have went to, went to war with the Forgers earlier. So if you're playing this campaign as the Iron Alliance, you might want to try out the uh, uh, taking out the Forgers first. 44, well, no one's really attacking us right now. Maybe wait a little bit. I think, I since I have forts up here, maybe having these guys on the line wasn't the best idea. I wonder if I can bait the enemy AI into attacking me just a little bit more. Come back up to good good springs, fellas. If not, maintenance efficiency, good. More doggo support, good. Or really, instead of that, you know, what, what am I thinking? Just come back down to the line. They're not going to attack me right now because I'm going to attack them. All right, see what happens. They're not attacking us too much. Good. Awesome. Now I'm going to attack here next. They don't have a lot of stuff. They can still pierce us. Our generals are way more experienced, though. Oh my goodness. Awesome. They're still attacking. Glorious. Lost 36 guys versus a thousand. A thousand already. 
Not bad. Now they don't—they didn't like that. Now they're attacking me across the entire front. How many bombers are we producing a week now? Fighters don't really need them. Point two. Not bad. Not great, but not bad. Hmm. Oh, if I have to attack, I have to attack that way. So be able to take New Monroe. We can take supply from them. Awesome. Oh, and then I guess you guys could just go that way. Could have made an encirclement, but whatever. That's okay. Give me half of you guys. Come down there. Oh, crap. I guess that's not really going to be an encirclement because they already left. So be it. Uh, infantry is struggling a little bit. Give them one support robot as well. Two divisions won't be able to hold out for that long. There you go. You don't need to move. Um, well, we've killed quite a few guys so far. Pretty good, I'd say. Do we need any more stability? Uh, yeah, we could use more. Encourage weapon. Uh, add minus two off map arms workshops. Yeah, no thanks. Um, if we want to add something here, definitely justify World Goals times. That stuff is pretty good to have. Alright, you guys. What if I selected you, but you guys would do that. And you guys would do that, and we'd take out maybe just a single division. Not a lot. Just a single division. And I thought this would be a lot more difficult just because I was expecting them to pierce pierce me more and more than what they're currently doing. But theming numbers is now adaptable and we made a small, small little encirclement. Not very much to speak of, but you know, whatever. We don't need everyone moving at the same time. Oh, and they're attacking us again. Pretty normal. Pretty darn normal. What's their manpower like? Not bad. Digital data links. Love it. Decryption. Beautiful. And they want to attack us like crazy. They're actually kind of winning down here, but not for long. Thieving numbers. You have another upgrade slot? Holy cow. Thieving numbers. I'm so glad I have you here. Ah, oh, they can't do anything to me. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. I'll let you guys get prepared to come down to your new Cortez. Not bad. Let them just waste themselves on my line. We've lost less than 100 guys so far. Free fighters. Mexico's on fire again. Um, they've lost almost 8,000. Approaching 8,000 men. Uh, dead men. Level 4. Where you? Oh, the other heavy robots coming in. Nice. Standardized tools. Let's next get some refined tools. Oh, they're actually waiting down here, so which means we must start attacking. Give our robots a little bit more attack. You know, give the infantry some more attack as well. There you go. Oh, that's a lot of divisions they're attacking with. Not bad. The Heidi Confederation was finally annexed by the Broken Coast. You almost can't even tell the difference. And now we are going to slowly start pushing into here. Beautiful. 8,000. Almost 9,000. Awesome. Losses. Not bad. Military training for a good doggos. I want those cybernetic doggies. Give me the some robot doggos. Oh man, if we could take these guys out here, that would be awesome. Just straight up awesome. And considering this, they guys, these guys could hurry up. Actually, just come down here. Just go ahead and start doing this area. Yeah, there you go. Actually. Oh, that's 25 only. Darn it, guys. Oh, side channel attack. The digital encryption. How about some of that good stuff? Well, they can't pierce me. They've lost a lot of their piercing power, which is great. There goes Mexico again. What is going on down there? Just a lot of dead Mexicans, I guess. That's unfortunate. Um, yeah, it's on fire. Pretty normal. She, they're all hanging out. Jet engines, nice. Jet bombers. Oh, baby, tell me more. And they have literally not even moved here. Beautiful. This area up here has been pretty quiet for a while. I don't like it. It's too quiet. As our robots are moving in. Love it. I'm going to upgrade to level 6. What are you learning, thieving numbers? He's learning to become more of an organizer. A bullet Eater is becoming more and more of an urban assault specialist. A little bit. And, yeah, he doesn't have that much, that many upgrades. 258 versus almost 11,000. Not bad. Let's go ahead and turn you down to be a little bit more balanced, just in case. Supply, I mean, we're not suffering from any sort of supply issues right now, but... Not bad. Can they pierce me? 
No. Give him a little bit more attack. Uh, check out our equipment. We're still doing very, very well. I love it. And basic power armor. Yeah, I'm going to start researching a lot more stuff into power armor. Organic processors. Great. Still a little bit ahead of time. 122 days. Uh, I know I want to do power armor, but we might as well do that for now. And then we'll do some more power armor, because I do want to throw in a few power armor divisions. Old Cortez. Good old, good old Cortez. Oh, new Nuvajo. Oh, wow, that's a lot of territory we took. Resources. Oh, we might need to start thinking about our energy, though. Just a little bit. Oh. Why don't you guys come down here? You guys do something like that. There you go. And you guys, I want you to focus right here, and you guys focus up this way. Oh, it's a pause. There you go. Oh, okay, you wanted to do that. That doesn't make any sense. What's a, whatever, but whatever. Oh, we're getting attacked, too. No good luck. Oh, we got plenty enough to do this. Air Force? Oh, that's Navy. Fighter production? Eh. Eh. War support isn't bad. More attack? I'm thinking more attack. Consumer goods. Stability goes down, but we get more daily political power as well as consumer goods. Oh, that's... Instead of attack, this is not bad because I want to core more territory eventually. So, Webster Jaden, welcome aboard. Alright, and I will end this episode once the war is over, since we are getting attacked a little bit like crazy, but that's okay. Go ahead and start upgrading the infrastructure here when you can, because it's pretty bad around here. Oh, and our planes probably can't reach them down there. Yeah. There you go. Northeast Arizona. Good old Arizona. There you go. That's what was lacking here. They're going to get bombed all to heck. They've lost 13,000 men. Beautiful. Brotherhood Paladin Exile. There's that's quite a few guys. They haven't lost a lot of divisions, though. Uh, let you guys stop doing that. Yeah. There's no point to attack that way. Just kind of hold. Don't lose here. If we lose this tile, we're kind of sunk. So. There you go. And have you just come this way. If possible. Don't get encircled, though. You guys can stop attacking like that. Yeah, if we, if we lo would lose old Cortez, we would probably lose all of our army. And that obviously is not quite ideal. Oh, get new Navajo possible. You guys, you move up there, and then you just wrap yourself around here. Alright, if we're attacking, we might as well attack with full force, right? Cybernetic enhancements. Oh, cyber doggos, yes. Oh crap, I want to do more power armor stuff. Whatever. Let's see. Um Still couldn't quite Oh, we did get new Navajo, but the lines are kinda funky. Oh, it's the factories. Bombers. Mm, we got plenty enough of that stuff. We got a lot of a lot of good stuff here. If possible, I guess if you have anything left over, make some power armor. They're not even close to capitulating, which is unfortunate. Not quite unfortunate, but that's okay. Go ahead and start pushing in a little bit. Let these guys focus down over here. I know this video is going to go on quite a while, but I don't want to disappoint you guys. I want to show you everything I'm doing right now. So, with you guys, well. From front line down here. New Navajo's a little bit annoying, but whatever. That's okay. Just a little bit annoying to fight. And you guys. You know what? Don't even move. I need you to continue holding that area. Where's my infantry? Oh, yeah. So they're there. That's good. Oh, good. Even more divisions. Now we can really pump out a lot of good divisions here. Ah, yes. Keep attacking. See what you can do. They're still... They're not connected. If I could take Del Norte, that would be great. Just a little bit more time. 59. 64. Encourage basic hygiene. 
That sounds like a good thing to do. Oh, they're attacking here. All right, well. What if we attack with the robots? Let them think that they can win. Oh, we took an airbase. Yeah, come on down here then. So much easier. Just so much quicker to get down here. There you go. And you want to lose. No, 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 no. You guys, get up here. Refined tools, very nice. Advanced tools, very good. And... Great. Nice, you guys are up here. Just... just oh, that's a capital, god dang it. Um, I could tell you guys to go. Go crazy. Not a bad idea. Give him a little bit more attack. Except I'll send you this way. Go ahead, hold. These guys are going to starve anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, y'all. Take these guys out. Not bad. Not bad. Just need a little bit more time to kill all these guys off. go. Having a good time. Well, someone is. And we're starting to run out of energy cells, which isn't good, but the war shouldn't la go on for that much longer if I'm using all these guys. So we'll definitely have to research or get some energy wind turbine places. Cool. And nine divisions, or I guess that's actually eleven divisions, have just perished. Beautiful. And our infantry's doing very well. Good job, Bullet Eater. He's very good on defense. Very, very, very good on defense. Digital encryption. Decryption. Awesome. Now, as you can tell, we're going to need a lot of divisions to help hold the line against Kaisar's Legion. Because we got so many entrances where they could come in. It's going to take a while for us to kill them off. Take us quite a while. Does, does my infantry currently use energy cells? No, that's good. Bombers. Well, awesome. Vehicles. Go ahead and do that. Oh, I need to do power armor. Ah. Oh well. What's done is done. Can't take away the past. Only learn from it. Honestly, I really don't need everyone to come down this way at the exact same time, but whatever. Three more divisions. We're having a good time with them. 30,000. I know this video is going on very long. I didn't expect it to go on this long, but whatever. Awesome. Get down there. Come on. Come through. Good, good, good. As we bait them into attacking our infantry constantly. Ah, oh, yes. Keep on trying, guys. Keep on trying. Energy cells. I'm going to stop using these planes for now. Oh, cyber doggos. Yes. Uh, oh, wait. No, 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 no. Power armor. There you go. Purebred mutts. I prefer my dogs. Cyberific. Come on. Tierra Amarela. Ooh, even more stuff. Well, that's just bombers. That was just close, closer support fighters. Um, ground blimp. Really, nothing. None of this really matters that much. Fighters, I guess. Heavy fighters, long fighters. It really doesn't matter to me. So let's go with tanks instead. Alright, there goes some more Mexico. Yeah, we're out of uh, energy cells. Unfortunate, but oh well. Losses. 665 versus... Oh, that's a lot of guys. That is a lot of guys. Alright, so we need to produce some energy stuff, but we need to research that stuff first. Um... I mean, obviously, as, as we build more infrastructure, we'll have more and more and more, so. Let's go ahead and just start put, put that under production for now. Awesome. Mark robots. Robo brains. I'll research that stuff eventually. Doesn't matter. Just kill them off if you can. I want to reduce the usage of energy cells as much as possible, but whatever. Oh, you guys are fairly low organization. Adaptable bullet eater, you're doing a great job. 
They just keep trying to throw in more and more divisions. But it ain't gonna work. Come on, guys. I'm not gonna use all these guys to attack next. Uh, give me my heavy robots. That should be good enough. Good. Holding out. Holding out. Let all these other guys just kind of hang out. Maybe move them up there or something. Maybe move a division over to here. I don't want you guys to go to Chaco Mesa. Chaco Mesa. Uh, does anyone like me yet? Oh, of course not. Why would they? Give them a little bit more defense before the robots show up. Let's see. Currently, our army uses 127 a day. Mexico's on fire, of course, again. So required. We see 0 0.04 a day. 0% maximum consumption. Yeah, this video's going on a very long time. Oh, well. How much manpower do they have left? Jesus. Oh, none. 37,000. Yep, Mexico's definitely on fire. NCR war. They haven't advanced at all. Um, nothing's going on down here. Advanced tools. Resources. More recycling. There you go. 33, 34, 35, 36. Come on, power armor divisions. You know what? I think this has gone on long enough. 50 some minutes in this video, and we still haven't killed them off yet. I'll kill them off really soon, and we'll be prepared for the next video in the next one anyway. So, anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed this super long video. Uh, if you did, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link below, and tomorrow we're going to start focusing on that uh, Mormon Alliance as we are. Uh, Going to be producing way more divisions and a lot of energy stations as well. Thanks for watching. Hope you all have a great, great day.